One of the most common questions I get is, do we need to write our automation code in the same language that the application is written in? If we're writing test automation and the application is written in JavaScript, do we need to write the test in JavaScript? If the application or the API is in Java, do we need to write it in Java? If it's in Python, do we need to write it in Python? And the answer is absolutely not. We don't. The automation code does not have to be the same as the application code. When we're testing the application, at least from a QA perspective, most of the tests are user acceptance tests. So we are testing the application as if the user is using it. So the user that's using our application, whether it's a front end or a back end, has no idea how the application is built. If it's, if it's a back end, the user is just making an API call. The application itself can be a Node.js application, it can be a Java application, it can be a Python application. The same thing with the front end. All you know is you open it a browser and you interact with it. So our tests are simulating what a user would do. So it doesn't matter what language we write it in terms of our tests. So the application can be a React JavaScript application. Our test could be in Python. It could be in JavaScript too. And then we can match it. We don't have to match it. So overall, just because a lot of websites are built with JavaScript, that doesn't mean you have to learn JavaScript for automation. In fact, for automation, Python is the most recommended one because it's very universal and it goes a long way, pretty much. So I just wanted to answer that quick question. I'm a estate software engineer in test and all I do is teach people to become QA automation engineers and estates. I do work one-on-one -on -one with people. I have one-on-one -on -one coaching and I have a membership and courses and everything else. So make sure you check out the details in the description and in the bio. I'm sure you love my stuff. And if you want to see more things like this make sure you follow and subscribe and like this video so other people know this exists